Welcome to NH Tech. In this video we will learn how to perform DC simulations in advanced design system. Let's start by creating a new project, give it a name, and then open a new schematic. Now place a DC simulator in the schematic. Next, place an NPN transistor model. All the basic characteristics of this NPN transistor are given by default, but you can modify them to match a real transistor by taking parameters from its datasheet. After that, place a DC voltage source and a current source into the schematic Rearrange for the items Search for a current probe Make the connections The next step is to place a parameter sweep simulator into the schematic. We also need to define variables, so place a variable block and double click on it. For this example, we will define two variables, IBB and VCE, both initialized to zero. Now double click on the DC simulator and set the sweep parameter. Let's choose VCE as the sweep variable. Set the start value to 0, stop value to 10, and step size to 1. You can also change the display settings here to select which parameters to show in the simulation results. Next step is to set the parameter sweep setting. Set the sweep variable equal to IBB and in sim instance name number 1 to DC1 to link it with the DC simulator. Take the start value of IBB to 1 microampere and stop 11 microampere with a step value to 1 microampere. Set the DC voltages of power supply to VCE. Ice to IBB. Now the setup is ready. When you run the simulation, now open a rectangular plot and select a variable to plot. You will get the DC IV curves of the transistor, showing how the collector current varies with VCE for different values of IBB. This is how you can easily perform DC simulations and generate IV characteristics of a BJT transistor in ADS.
Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to NH Tech.